While it's not even Halloween yet, in the theme park world, it's almost pre-Christmas because basically most of the theme parks start their Halloween activities and parties sometime in August. So now that we're into mid-October, people are starting to look toward Christmas. So whether you like it or not, that's kind of how it tends to go. And in terms of theme parks with Christmas, obviously a lot of people look toward Disney and the things that they do. But over the years, I've really enjoyed the things that Universal has to offer. And a lot of people are wondering what they might do with Epic Universe as they will have a brand new theme park, a lot more attendance, and maybe do some Christmas type activities that they don't do in the other parks. Well, we might get a glimpse of something that could come to Epic Universe because Universal Studios Hollywood is doing some new Christmas decorations in Super Nintendo World. So we got an article here from Inside Universal, and we'll just talk about real quick what they're doing and give some thoughts on it. So hi, I'm Jared with Capture the Magic. And again, it says Universal Studios Hollywood expands 2024 holiday festivities to Super Nintendo World and dates are announced. Uh, it says Universal Studios Hollywood has announced the holidays at Universal Studios Hollywood will be returning starting Friday, November 29th and running daily through Monday, January 6th of 2025, expanding their festivities to include Super Nintendo World along with traditional favorites Grinchmas and Christmas in the Wizarding World of Harry Potter. For the first time, Hollywood Super Nintendo World will welcome guests to celebrate the holidays in the Mushroom Kingdom alongside Mario, Luigi, Princess Peach, and Toad, a tree adorned with a superstar topper, festive wreath, and two snowmen, one donning a red Mario hat and scarf and the other a green Luigi hat and scarf, will greet guests for a memorable photo op. I have to say, it's pretty almost built in the fact that with Nintendo, you have the stars and things. So, it you know, having the that star on top of the tree and everything else, uh, it, it seems like a pretty good fit. And then they also said, once inside the Mushroom Kingdom, the spirit of the holidays will shine bright and with themed decor. Guests will be able to enjoy an array of holiday merchandise at select retail locations and seasonal treats at Toadstool Cafe. And then they go on about how they've got the Grinchmas as well, which they do that in uh, Orlando also, which I have to say, I do love the Grinch things that they do at Christmas. You have the breakfast, you have the meet and greet you can do, although difficult to be able to get in to do it. Uh, and they also have the Grinchmas show, which is one of the best shows that I've seen in a theme park. Like it legitimately is a play that, you know, you probably would expect to be charged for considering the quality and the high production value that it is. But, in, you know, and whoever they have, I'm sure they have multiple people playing the Grinch. I've never seen a bad Grinch of whoever's playing the Grinch. They do a very, very good job when it comes to the Grinch stuff. And they go on about Hogsmeade as well, and they do things, you know, at Orlando as well with the lights and the uh, the castle show and things like that. So, uh, but looking at this with Super Nintendo World is what I really was looking at because I just, I love the idea that Peach's Castle has the wreaths. They do holiday stuff. So this is something that, you know, perhaps we could see this coming, or not this one, but the next Christmas when Epic Universe is open, we very well could see some Nintendo Christmas things in Super Nintendo World. You know, they possibly could do other things in other lands as well. But I am curious in the other lands, you know, in Epic Universe, like how much stuff will they do for Christmas? I just don't know if they're going to put like Celestial Park, How to Train Your Dragon, or any of those. Maybe all of them, or maybe none of them. I, I don't really know what they'll do. I hope they do though, because I love Christmas, and I love seeing like the different types of things on there, and just the idea with Super Nintendo World as well with the star and then the the power-up boxes as the ornaments. It's it's a pretty natural fit, uh, but I just want to highlight that because I think that hopefully we see this coming next year as, uh, you know, on top of Epic Universe probably, I would assuming next year being a massive success and very busy around the Christmas season as it would be within its first year of being open. Uh, we very well could see some Super Nintendo Christmas stuff, and I would uh, I would be there for it for merchandise as well. I think it'd be really cool. But uh, either way, I just want to point that out. Thought it'd be something that might be coming to Epic Universe that I personally would really enjoy, uh, and maybe some other things as well. But if you are out in uh, Universal Studios Hollywood, you will be able to enjoy this this year and uh, take in all the Christmas festivities. But either way, that's going to do it for this video. If you like this video, please like it and subscribe to the channel as we do lots of coverage here of Universal Studios, Epic Universe, Disney World, and pop culture. Let us know in the comments what do you think about Super Nintendo World being themed for Christmas, and do you think they might do other lands in Epic Universe for Christmas as well? And until next time, we will see you in the parks.